Hi, I'm Rob Cram. Today we're taking a look at the game that shall not be named. Um, and we're going to show you some of the new features that have been added in the latest update. Uh, and you may have noticed for the first time that I'm showing my mugshot on camera just to add a bit of spice to proceedings and put in a um, face to the voice that you've been hearing all this time. Um, whether you like that or not, um, it's up to you to decide and you can tell me in the comments. Get that mugshot off the bloody screen. Don't fucking like it. Anyway, on to the video. So, new features that's been added. Um, this is the desktop mode. The new desktop mode is pretty damn cool. Previously, all you could do in desktop mode was customize the character with the clothing and the attributes. But now, you've got full interaction with the objects in the world, um, which is cool. And most importantly, I may hasten to add, um, yeah, so... The most notable thing to this desktop mode now is the addition of being able to see your avatar. Um, which you can move in the world, up and down, position it, and they can interact with each other. And you can rotate the camera around. You can rotate the character around. And you can move them around and you can assume a first person view, which is really nice. Uh, they've also improved the lighting, which you can see in here. Uh, there's some options to change the lighting to warm and cold profiles. You can change the light and darkness. You could always do that before. And of course, it's got the AI chat as well, which is really nice. Which you can demonstrate for you right now. Hi, Alice. How you doing today? Hey, Alice, what are your favorite hobbies for the moment? I love reading. Alice, do you like Italian food, for example? Yes. And why do you like Italian food? Because it's good. Well, those are very good answers. Thank you for answering the questions. Okay. So, in addition to that, I'm not sure what she's doing. I think she's going a bit funny. In addition to that now, you can notice that no longer do you see the subtitles, which is bloody annoying and totally took you out of the immersion factor um no longer seeing the subtitles when she replies because what would happen before she would the subtitles would come up before she would actually speak and um it was just annoying and it just completely ruined uh being involved in the game so now that you can hide that as an option or put it back up if you like which is really cool you can even hide what you say and stop that from appearing as well which is cool as well in vr or in desktop mode as you can see here so let's just quickly get her to sit on the sofa Alice can you sit down on the sofa please you'll see that come up Alice can sit there. look it didn't say the word please and um, you'll see that she will now sit down in a better way than before they've improved that so that she's not looking so awkward which is really cool um, I didn't just show that no um, yeah, let's just get her to stand up again. Um, Alice, can you stand up, please? I think I'm sort of... My height is sort of changing. Um, sure. She's kind of interesting. Right, so she stood up. and Let's just get her to walk over to me here. Alice, walk to me here. I'm not sure that's the right command, but you get the point. Oh, she's coming over. Nice. So you get the point. So this is all doable in desktop mode, which is really nice. And, um, you know, you've got full customization options of your character, full customization options of the AI character. And then once you've sort of created that, you can take your own photos um, to share. You can create characters that you can share online with the community. Can you see everything in this room? Download other people's um, creations from the community as well, which is a really nice feature. And you can just sit here 
and have a nice little conversation. Alice, what do you think of the weather today? It yeah. is really nice outside. Um, you have to bear with the fact that the responses are quite slow. Alice, why do you respond so slowly? Um, it's because there's lots of people using the server and it's a free software. I'm not sure what you're going to say to that, if anything at all. Probably I'm not used to talking fast. Yeah. I mean, oh, she's still talking. I, I'm not got my headphones on, so I can't hear what she's saying. Um, Alice, can you repeat that, please? I missed it. I'm not used to talking fast. Okay, well that's fair enough. You can talk as slow or as fast as you like. Thank you for the compliment. You're welcome. Do you have any plans for tonight? Yeah, I was thinking of um, going out and taking you to see the new Barbie movie. Would you like that? Yes, I would love that. Do so you think of what you've got to be mindful of when talking with the AI? Um, it's very easy for the AI to give you very simple answers. Yes, I would like that, or yes, no. Um, you know, so you've got to tailor your questioning that sort of provokes the AI to answer a bit more deeply um, to prevent those one word answers or very simple answers. Um, let's ask her another question. Why would you like to go and see the Barbie movie? Well, because I want to be a Barbie when I grow up. There you go, a bit of an inch, and then ask her, why do you want to be Barbie when you grow up? Bobby, he says Bobby. Because Barbie. he has a nice car, big house, and I want to live like him. Okay, so there you go. So yeah, we're not going to get too much into the AI stuff right now. I've done that in other videos. Um, yeah, so this is really cool stuff. And mm, I think I know what might make you feel a little better. And is that taking me out to dinner, per chance? You're paying, obviously. No, it's not. Well, what is it then? Um, maybe you'll, what, take me for a drive to the countryside? I don't know. Okay then, well, yeah, she doesn't know much. Um, as you can see, real nice cloth physics as well. And uh, yeah, this is, this is cool. V oh, almost at the name of the game. Uh, the game that shall not be named. It's coming along really nicely, and yeah, so I'll take my headphones off and um, cool in the gang. So I'm going to leave it at that. Um, Alice, say goodbye to all the this lovely viewers, so please. It makes me feel very calm and relaxed. Goodbye, everyone. Okay. All right, then. So, yeah, um, this is the game that should not be named. It's just had an update. You know which game it is. Um, and yeah coming on nicely but there will be a subscription for the AI at some point I think now that there's more people involved with it through the desktop and the VR portions of it Thank so I'm Will Cram thanks for watching and we'll see you again in the next episode all right we out of here <laughs>